Hello, I'm James Clark from the Department of Physiology at King's College London, and in this short tutorial I'm going to show how we can make animated slides accessible for when you upload them for sharing with students on Keats. What we have in front of us is one slide from a presentation looking at electrophysiology of the cardiac muscle. If I show this slide, you'll see that there is an animation. The animation simply brings in a series of arrows which point either in or out of the cell. Whilst during your presentation and subsequent production of an MP4 file, these arrows may serve a purpose as part of the narrative. They serve no purpose whatsoever as animated arrows in a static presentation, such as the one you'll be uploading for your students in order for them to see the information. So, in order to make these accessible, the first thing we should do is check the accessibility checker and see what errors come up. So if I go to the review tab and choose check accessibility, immediately we will see that these arrows and rectangles have no alt text and there is a warning about the reading order. What the warning about the reading order means is that there are animations on this slide that don't make contextual sense. In the absence of a narration, I would agree that these arrows do not need to be animated. So, let's sort this out. First and foremost, let's get rid of the animation. So we go to the animation pane, show the animation list, and remove all four animations. So let's run this slide again. Now there are no animations, therefore we won't have a problem with these animations anymore. We do have a problem with our alt text, however. Each of these arrow items and each of the boxes have no alt text associated with them. So to remove this as a problem and make this slide accessible, select all of the items, right-click and choose Group, and then create a single alt text which simply states the purpose of the figure and we could write in this box that this is a figure describing the movement of ions in and out of a cell. So now we have removed our animations, grouped our images and created a single alt text which describes the complex process in a simple form, we have eliminated any problems with accessibility on this slide. So this slide can now be uploaded for sharing with students. If you found this tutorial useful, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel.